Welcome back to another video tutorial for how to Windows and how to Outlook.com. This is Mark, and I will show you how to get what you want from your computer before you reinstall Windows. First, let's get the first link and paste that into a browser. This is a Microsoft tool that helps synchronize two folders instantly. Make sure you get the 86 if you have 32-bit or 64 if you have 64-bit. Once done downloading, install it. There's no bloatware in this program, so you don't have to go slowly through the installation. Once it's installed, run the program. The program will now have a screen that shows you a left folder and a right folder. Click on the Create New Folder pair. Now click on Left Folder. Select the folder you want it to keep synchronized. Then in the right folder, select where you want it to save it to. Then finish the rest of the setup process. Now another thing good to do before reinstalling Windows is to see what programs you have and what the serial numbers are for those programs if necessary. This program here will tell you pretty much everything there is to know about your computer. Now in this setup, there is bloatware, so be careful as to when you press next. This is not necessary, you can uncheck the I accept if you want. Launch the program, then click on installed programs. This will tell you what programs you have in detail, including the serial keys. Sorry I blurred mine out. Now this program has so much more information. This is your computer as a whole, all in one place. You can find drivers, you can find licenses for Windows or Microsoft, You can even learn about your operating system. You can even see if you had scheduled tasks. You can also learn about your components just by clicking on them. And if you didn't like the long programs list, you can just click on this to see the applications with the icons. Another good thing to do before reinstalling Windows is to back up your Outlook PSD files. You can follow this link to learn how to do this, automatically or even manually. This next program is for the new computer that you're going to have. If you don't have a zip application, 7-Zip is a free alternative to Winmar. Make sure you get the correct one corresponding to your operating system. If you get the same error as me, just click try again and then click this link. Install the program and don't worry about bloatware, there is none in this setup. If you want a program for burning things to CDs and want a free alternative, Image Burn is a great alternative. This program also comes in many different languages. However, if you do want it in English, click one of these. I like Softpedia. Click download, then press a mirror. I'm in US, so I'll press US. Once downloaded, install it. This program does have bloatware during the installation, so be careful to uncheck it. Click no to this pop-up. I clicked yes, but it was useless. Just press no. Once you're in the program, there's a very easy layout, and it's very easy to use. If you want more free alternatives to these types of programs, then you can go to this website. You can sort by most views and most likes, or whatever else. But basically, this is where you get all of the programs. It's a great website.